Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. Guys, today I create really cool lighting 3D logo animation with using guys I use Cinema 4D and second After Effect. So firstly, guys, I use Cinema 4D and take more text. Guys, I type any letter like S and alignment take middle. And guys, change font. Font I use Arial Black this one right guys go on display select god shading lines and that i take 30 centimeter and i increase segments take two three time and intermediate points guy i take a uniform and numbers i take only one one i create low poly text and guys go on caps and create single object check and now go on type i take quad angles and regular grid check and guys breadth size i take 15 centimeter guys this is my low poly text and after that make editable so select this more text and make editable again go on layer right click select children one more time guys right click connect object plus delete that's it okay now guys i use plugin this is called net creator this one i show you see guys this is my plugin you can download from my website right so open this plugin select this net creator open right go on back select this net creator and copy and guys go on your c drive and program file guys go on maxon Guys, this is my Cinema 4D R19 open and I go to plugin and right click and paste. Guys, I already paste this plugin C, right? After paste, so close and guys restart your Cinema 4D. So you can close, right? Okay, now guys use plugin this one. So select this net creator and I go to object. Guys, see this is my object A. Select this more text and I create vertex. So, guys, select this point and select any point and I go to select and take set vertex and value I take 100% and press OK. That's it, guys. Right? Now, after that, see this is my vertex. And select this net creator select more text drag and drop in object a yeah great and I go to distance and guys max distance I take only 20 and guys you can hide this more text hide and hide on render see this is my wire effect okay now guys I create wire animation so go on again object See guys, this is my vertex map A. Select this vertex map, drag and drop in here. Yes, and I go to here, enable check and turbulence check. Go on back and play. Yes, see guys, this is my wireframe animation. So speed guys, I take one. Yeah, great. Right? Okay, now guys, you can apply here object material and it's depend on your work, but I create this line. Actually, I take this circle and circle radius, I take 0 0.2 and I take swap. Guys, select this net creator and circle and make child with swap. Yes, see guys, hide lines. Go on back and play. See, that's really cool. Right? So guys, stop. I apply material. Go on create and take load material. Guys, select your material. This is my material. And open. Right? And apply anything like blue. Actually, this one, blue. And apply on swap. Yes. Yeah, great. 
right guys this is my simple animation so guys stop now i create light so i take only sky and guys go on create a new material open guys luminance only take luminance and this is my hdr light and open and no and guys brightness i take 200% 200 so close apply on sky yeah right and now guys i take camera and camera check and guys right click on this sky right click compositing tag and use this one and seen by camera uncheck that's it guys so render preview yeah great see guys this is my wire effect okay and guys little bit smaller and i create animation so go on back here guys select this camera and camera check and play go on here and guys go to 70 frames and camera change like this and check that's it guys see yeah great okay so guys stop i create render setting guys i take only png file transparent png jpeg sequences so go on render setting output i take full hd frame this one and frame range use all and guys this is most important alpha channel check and format i take this one png right and this my save file path go on desktop create any name folder like png new and take any file name guys i take only mb occlusion and global illumination that's it guys anti i take only geometry so close and render see guys this my renders and now so close guys i already take renders i show you here see guys this is my this one this is my renders it's png transparent file see right guys i import this render in after effect so close go on after effect right this is my after effect go on project right click import and import file so go on back import your jpeg sequences on this one select and png sequence check yes guys select this sequence drag and drop and play yeah great right guys okay now i create background bg new and i take solid layer and take bg guys apply ramp effect type ramp select and apply and guys change this radial and i take dark blue yes go on mid and increase size like this yes right okay now go on down select this guys my renders and create duplicate go to edit and duplicate here and guys select first one and again go on effect and preset type cc fast select cc radial fast blur apply yes right and guys also apply glow glow select apply and apply on both layers right see guys this really good
right okay and lastly guys i use optical flare light so go on create a new solid layer type light and press okay go on effect video go pilot and use optical flare go to option and guys type any light like this one and mode i take add go to here brightness change like 40 and guys copy this light control d and position change go on here yeah see guys this is my final render right it's really beautiful okay so stop guys go on recomposition this is my add render queue and guys again i take jpeg sequences and you can take avi format right and press ok output and save and render so guys my tutorial animation is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download all projects and materials from my website thank you